This is this this one right here is a tough one. This is one that has quickly became one of my favorites. I love the drums in this thing, man. This uh uh Kareem Rennings. Oh man. First of all, let me say this. Dude is dope. Like he's a dope drummer producer anyway. Let me come this way so I'm not in the, in the screen there. But when he put this out, man, this thing is it sounds so good, bro. Like those drums that he created with this was I was man, when it first dropped, I said, Oh bro, oh bro, oh bro. This dude uh, like he was around with the J Dillas, man. And this dude got a sound. So you're talking about coming, Erica Badu. Uh, he did some stuff with Jay Dilla back in the day. I remember his story, man. He was saying how he dropped, like, he was dropping tapes. And they was telling him that he needed to get organized because he had all these tapes with different stuff on there. And uh, so he started, he got, his first, he got his first song with Jay Dilla. But then he went on to work with so many more other great artists. And, uh, man, so this is even something that I love that Play Series is doing. They're making drums. And I think it, I, I don't remember any before uh, 40, uh, 40s series that he dropped. I don't remember any drums before the 40 series uh, that he did. And it could be, and I just not. I, I just may not know what I'm talking about. Um, K Sound, I know you probably can tell me this. Um, he is, uh, I see Kareem is uh, what made it on my app. I know, bro. I know, man. I know I heard him. I heard him. Uh, matter of fact, bro, you was the reason, like you, you was the, you was the reason I pulled the trigger to get him. Like when I heard it on the tr on the album, I was like, I got to have them, cause they was cut through. They was cut through just right, and I said, Oh no, I got to get them. But uh, but yeah, man, uh, I don't rem I don't remember anything before forty, but I was glad that they started doing this on the play series because it's still the same concept. They just got drums in them now. So let's go ahead and uh, go back to the track here and we're going to add some drums so let's go ahead and pull this up here and this is a quick run through because it's not it's not a lot of them on here but we can go through them real quick here oh my gosh man Like it's hard to even say anything on this stuff, bro. Uh. Is it how yeah, organic those drums sound, bro? Uh. go with that one right um now as you can see right i'm gonna tell you what's dope about these right like you hit this one there's two of them So you can do that or one. Ooh. I love that. 
<laughs> now, one thing you got to understand too with this. So you playing. So you can also switch it up too. So you hit the different keys and it stays in the timing of whatever the BPM in the track is, right? That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. Um, that's crazy. So now you also have like the filters. Again, the knobs, man. That's crazy. I I know I know y'all bobbing y'all head to it. I know you is. You have to be. You have to. I know it. I know it. Let me make sure I ain't missing nothing. See so you gonna make create another app. Hey hey K sound. You have to, bro. You got to man. Because I need something else to uh go to work to. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, so I'm going to do this for whoever. Uh, if you want to go ahead and purchase again, this is an affiliate link. Go get you some. Um, these are hip hop drums, jazz spirit, pioneer drums. As you can hear, you can hear them. They're authentic drums, man. They are unique to that sound, bro. They're unique, very unique. Let's, um, let me let me show this too, um, because I, I gotta go here. So what you can do, you can go into the uh, you can go into the main, which is this. You can go into the kit. So if you wanted, if you wanted to take this, all right? Let's say if I want to take that, I want to change to that or that. Let's say that right there. That's what's there, all right? So I'm gonna go here. You can set up different links to where they're like in like these sets or whatever the case may be. Uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, let's go back to that. Yeah, let's. All right. So you could do that. So you can set up the stems. You can set up the effects here. If you wanted to, I can go in here. Let's say I want to add a compressor. I can do that. So you can do all that. You can you can create, you know, whatever you want to in there. You can do all that in here. You can set up a choke group to where if you got hi hat and you got an open hi hat and you want them to cut each other off, you can do that here. You can do anything in this doggone thing, bro. Like you can really create um, with the pattern. Let's say if. Um, is no snare, right? No kick. It's a feel. Break down. So you have all these different things, right? If it's too fast, slow it down. Oh, <laughs> 
It's a whole nother vibe here. thing that you can do to get a feel for what you're doing right watch this so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go with something like that Something like that, right? So I think I'm gonna go with this one. So how do I wanna do this? Um, so let's go back to the session. Let's go here. Right, so now, let's say if I wanna go with this, right? Let's go ahead and get it, let's get it locked in. So if it, let's get it locked in, right? All right, so. All right, boom, so you got, we got it locked in now. Uh-oh, let's start it over, because I gotta do that. That's what I did wrong. Give me a second, y'all, I'm gonna get it together. Let me. Then boom, so here we go. Right. Now, now that I have the drum pattern, right? I got the drum pattern going, I still have these drums. So if I wanted to add, let's see if I wanted to add something. Right? So I'm going to add that little thing. I'm going to add that little kick right there. Uh, that's what I'm going to add. Let's go with... Uh, no, let's go back to the drums. That's where I'm supposed to be at. We're going to ignite... Initiate that little deal right there. So, oh, I did the wrong one. It's this one, I'm sorry. So now, let me just dial these in real quick. I'm on the uh, lunch pad, so I can just kind of dial them in real quick. All right, boom, there we go. So here we go. Maybe I'm going, it's, it's too fast, so. 
Let's see. Oh, it's here. But I got to. Let's do this. Nope. The other way. Basically, you put these where they go. Boom. Right. So now I have the actual preset, but now I'm building my own onto that. Right? That's that's dope to me. Even if you came back and basically dial the drums in the way that the preset is going, maybe you, maybe you like a part of what the preset is doing, but the other some of the other stuff that you don't like, well, you can dial it in exactly what it's doing, and then that way you can kind of take back what you're doing, so it allow you to do all. I love that. I love that. So now I have created this. <laughs> This is being choked out by something else, right? Because as I was playing it, it would not allow me to actually play it. So what I'm gonna do, I know this is here, and right here I see that it's in choke group A. So I'm gonna take this out of a choke group, right? Now, I love that. Uh, so now I can play it without any problems, right? So here we go. Let's do this. So it's a little louder than I want it to be. So I'm going to come in here. Take the volume. I think it's this one. Let's see. Nope. That's the stem. Yeah. So I'm bring that down just a little bit. Let's see.
Ya fui de It's simpler to uh, put in there. Let's do that. Feeling what is we we got going on here today? 